I know I expected Lucy to come, but she's already upset and messed up, and I thought that maybe I should come down and we should talk about cool. things, because we've obviously got a few things to talk about, haven't we? Yep, cool. So, I don't really know what's going on, but I just don't think that I'm willing to see another one of my friends really upset about you. Liv, yep. I don't want to argue with you. Yeah, I've known you a long time. I like you. I love you being with Arge. The last thing in the world I would want is for you to end with Arge. So and what What was that all about the other night then? Well, the reason why I've asked to meet her is because Truth is, Lucy slept with a boy behind her boyfriend's back, yeah? So you're telling me it's 100% true? One million percent true, I've got proof. She's asked my sister to lie, who would also admit it to Mario, that she stayed at her house instead of mine. The matter of the fact is, there's no way I'm going about people thinking I'm a liar. Well, I don't know if it's true or not, and I don't, I obviously, I, all I can take is my, my friend's word for it. I don't sleep with anyone behind my girlfriend's back, I was single, right? She's now let her boyfriend talk to me like I'm a bit of shit, which ain't gonna happen, because I'm no mug, right? literally talking down to me in front of my pal, right, and in front of the rest of the bar. So I'm going to let that go, that people think that old Mark made up that he slept with Lucy. I don't need to brag about sleeping with Lucy. Obviously, if it is true, then it's then it's uh, it's, it's not right. Do you think I need to lie about sleeping with a girl? Be serious, Lid. That's just really arrogant. Why no, it's true, though. Do you think I'm the sort of person to just make up a lie that I've slept with a girl? Seriously. I'm well, I don't, I don't want to talk about... I don't want to say anything. I don't want okay, I came here to talk about mine and your differences. Like, well, obviously, just... I came here after being with Lucy, so obviously I'm kind of involved in that. But I feel like as soon as you break up with a girl, you expect James to be there the whole time I, with you. Yeah, I, and I can't have that again. I know that you're quite a powerful person and you're quite authoritative and you think that, like, you kind of talk people into doing lid, things lid, 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 and lid. I don't want you taking them away from me again oh, like cool. you did before. Cool. Listen, you need to be more confident now. I'm not going to take Argent away from you. He's, he's not going to dump you. He's in love with you. It's as simple as that, yeah? I'm not going to lead him astray. I would never ever want you two to split up. I'm looking forward to the day you used to get married. I'm over the moon that you used to happy. I'll never let that happen, right? I don't like arguing with people. No, I'd rather you just, just don't get like on... people telling you the truth. You I just think you're quite disrespectful with girls. When I see L people L being L not treated very nicely, that really upsets me, and I have to stand up for them because I feel like I should fight people's battles. I want to say our differences, but it just every time we try and do it, it just never seems to get nowhere because you just you've told me what you think a thousand times. I don't need to keep hearing it unless you've got something nice to say to me. Just don't talk to me. I won't talk to you then. I haven't really got anything nice to say about you at all.